Hello everyone, thank you for joining me here. My name, of course, is Atomic Theory 8 Turns. Let's continue playing as Egypt. So, last time we took this city, Persepolis, and we're getting ready to attack Susa. Oh wait, Rio was conquered by Attila? Oh. As well as Sao Paulo, and Attila killed Brazil off. Which probably actually helped Attila quite a bit. They still have a settler down here. William has probably four cities. I we bet there'd be probably a city right here. We could probably settle over here as well. I need to settle more people. Uh, there's not really much else I can do at the moment. I'm keeping my ironclads kind of close by to make sure nothing gets by. Actually, let's, come, let's bring this one over here. So that we can have some sort of naval presence on this side. And we can always heal in our city-state. Uh, do we have... Oh, wait, I should have upgraded these battleships. Yeah, so right now, that costs an extra oil. And we get did get our iron back. Got more iron back. We will go to war with them next time because now we have better ships. And we have dyes, which grants us quite a bit of more of food so we can get a bigger population. So we finished barracks here. Carrier. Oh, carriers are pretty good. Amphitheaters. Factories. I love factories. But let's get some more culture. And you. You are actually probably in striking distance. I'm going to put you over here, though. Just because the might give us a little bit more edge and maybe they'll put some naval ships around here maybe maybe not uh we have 2,000 faith so uh view city 51 happiness i don't mind annexing you right now but there's really no point to it. they're building science and that's really what i want uh we converted porto we converted braga and we have two uses left and i forget who we said we were going to convert next time higher already has this all of us have it uh up here needs some islamic faith as well as Groningen. Groningen. 10, 10. Well, that's good enough. And let's end our turn. Now, I don't know exactly. Oh, we're settling up here. Awesome. I don't know particularly if. Oh, where am I sitting? Why are you over here? I don't know uh, when the game will be won for us or when we will win. So. I mean, I could, like, do an entire episode of this, and the next five minutes after that, I could win. And that wouldn't be very cool, of course. I mean, have five-minute episodes not very cool. So I'm going to try my best and maybe try to win at the end of this episode or in the next. Make it at least 15 minutes or so. I can't really promise you anything about that, um, obviously. So we'll just do our best. Granary, uh, you know, let's do it. We haven't built a granary there. That's the only thing we haven't built. So we might as well. An aqueduct... Uh, zoo, just because it gives us more happiness that we don't really need. We're going to build one island city here. Good. I'm going to put the Great War Infantry over here, and they're going to upgrade themselves. They've got so much money now. So much money that I'm going to build a monument. Just come here. I'm going to build a harbor, a oh, seaport, as well as a workshop. Now, they will produce a granary so they can really build stuff very quickly. And let's go back to war with uh, you guys. Until... They're... They've denounced us. Ma? Cool. Very nice. So, let us have a very good time with these guys. Susa, of course, like I said before, Ekbatana will be very difficult to take. But with these battleships, I'm fairly confident that we'll, we'll be just fine. Oh, I have artillery here too. Um, go ahead and attack that. Neither guys get in range anyway, so. Put you over here. I will put you. You're gonna get attacked anyways. So, I don't mind putting you. Oh. Oh, they have a battleship over there and another battleship over here. Go and destroy that if you can. You guys come down here. Can't really do very much, but that's okay. And I don't want them to get attacked by that group, so we'll put you over here. Can you. But you can attack the city already. Awesome. Oh, and we do have some extra bombers now. I want to put you over there, maybe? We do have three bombers to use. Great War Bomber number one. Well, let's see what you can do. You can bomb the city, which you're pretty good at. And you will heal every turn, even if it performs an action. I really want to bomb the battleship. But getting rid of any extra enemy presence will help. And we'll have capabilities to bomb Susa. Okay, we'll do that anyways. We've got two more great war 
Great War Bombers anyway, so I'm not really concerned about that. I need to make another Great Prophet or something like that. Maybe a Great Engineer. Alright. Next one, you are good at naval units and cities. So, oh yeah, you almost killed that one off. And this one is good at bombing cities. Which, actually, I'll probably send here just to help kill them off. And they won't take that much damage anyways. I thought I had some admirals around here. Admiral? Admiralty? We have a great engineer coming up here. Uh, can I buy anything? I don't really need a great profit anymore. A settler would be fun. A missionary would be good. Uh, can I build or buy any things with my faith? This place has so much faith. Walls. Oh, there's a cathedral. Very good. Another cathedral sounds very good as well. Uh, Thebes, and we made it all the way back here without doing anything else. I think that's good for now. Let me later purchase all these stuff, which costs a lot of money, but whatever. All right, pretty good turn. Oh, there's the admiral. How did I not miss? How did I miss him? And the battleship is going to get blown up. Oh, they're not concentrating their fire on a single target. That doesn't make sense, but that's okay. A few places we all like to visit. Rank ranks players by the number of civs over whom their culture has been influential. That's right. Oh, another. Oh, we already have a great engineer. Awesome. Uh, actually, we'll take. Um, actually, let's use this artillery first and see where we're at. I, I will take the city this turn. Ooh, connection between our newest city is done good. Let me actually send you. How far can you. Oh, you can go pretty far. You come over here, and you'll start bombing the crap out of. Uh, ooh, a merchant. I don't want to kill the merchant. Just. I don't know. I like the merchant. So the battleship will try to kill a battleship. It's not Hoi 4, but it's very close to Hoi 4. Oh wait, infantry, god dang it. Oh wait, Mr. Eiffel. Well, we don't really have that many places for you to produce your goods, sir. But I'm sure I can find some place that you could be used. Ooh, what's this? More, Even more strength against land units, more movement, more... I like the range. The range is always so nice. And you heal out, you can heal outside of friendly territory. Just go ahead and get rid of the battleship. That's a kind of a nuisance towards us. And we'll have you help destroy the remainders of Susa as we will attack. Oh, why did they attack my cavalry? They should have attacked these guys, my infantry. And within the first eight minutes, we have taken another state. Awesome. Go ahead and take a nap. You guys will. Position yourselves accordingly. Uh, I mean, they're in the water. <clears throat> we won't take that much damage, and our battleships should be able to finish these guys off. So, you guys, you're out of strength. You guys will just heal. And we're going to start positioning our units even better now. Um, come to Susa if you can. And research lab is done. Very nice. An opera house. Followed by. Oh, fish and granary. We need a barracks, a university, opera house, and a lot of police stations. Uh, we got a little bit of money. I don't mind buying the rest of the heroic epics. Pass a... Pass a... Pass a something. Leash needs to buy barracks. Oh, they're building that still. And we need to buy... Where is this? Leash, leash, leash. No, pass a, pass a, pass a. Not Pio and Pass a... I might have already passed it, yeah. Yeah, it was right here. Right in front of me. My bad. And we will go ahead and build the Heroic Epic for not much of a benefit, but still kind of nice to have. I will build an Arsenal for more happiness. We have 41. Uh, Colosseum for more happiness. And is that all we can do this turn? No, because I can move you guys around. So we'll probably station two artillery pieces here. Maybe a third one, even though we don't have three. And we'll start bombing the hell out of that city. Great. And you guys can't do very much. Unless William of Orange wants to kill us. Oh, we already are getting bombed. Bombed already by an enemy battleship. Oh, that's not too bad. You guys heal. You guys rebase here in Susa. I would like to upgrade these guys. You reheal. You guys, you could bomb. You might as well start bombing. What's this? Uh, the Netherlands have denounced the Huns. That's typical. Ooh, Biblos has given us a new unit. 
I hope it's not a military unit. I hope it's a great person. We got Sugar Lush has, now has two citizens, and you do, do need to heal. You need to heal as well, but you don't need to heal. So you'll start continue at least continue the bombings or the shore bombardment, as we all know from Point Four. You guys, you will have to unfortunately get in the water. You guys will have to come up here. And oh wait, we do have three things of you all. Come over here. Continue healing. The artillery taking your spot right there. Oh, we have, we have Yamamoto. Uh, that's one too many Admiral units, honestly, so. You guys hang out. What else are we gonna do? Factory sounds nice. A shrine. A market sounds very good. Military base. Sure. Choose production of a zoo, and we could cause an end turn button to fire. But I don't want to do that just yet, because actually I want to move this unit up here. And you might as well get in the water as well. Awesome. Oh! Oh shit! Oh, they killed my admiral. Well, that's okay. Wasn't really planning on using the two admirals anyways. Oh well. They had to do something against me. You know. Um, If I set you up now... I can't hit, that, which is fine. I didn't think I would be able to anyways. Oh, you can already deploy. Cool. But you guys can go ahead and bomb them anyways. You guys are good and strong. We'll be a little bit ahead to see if anyone's coming in. Oh wait, I should have sent you guys to attack. Oh, whoops. Uh, let's move you up and around. Move you into the water. Uh, go ahead and bomb the enemy battleship. You guys get over here. You guys get over here. We'll probably end up going in the water. If I had to take Attila out, I'd probably take out with, start with Rio first. Uh, you guys are doing great. Go ahead and bomb the city since that's your, since you're pretty good at that anyways. And you know what? I'm going to send the cavalry here as well. They're, they're fast. They might be able to do well. They'll probably end up dying, but you know, I need some sort of distraction. Cool. And it looks like that's all we can really do right now. Why are there so many caravels around here? Oh, William has declared war on Attila, and Darius, had, Darius has declared war on Attila as well. That's not going to end very well for you guys. I mean, you're already at war with me, Darius. Alright, let's go ahead and bomb them. I just need some sort of melee unit here. And by melee unit, I'm talking about infantry. And about this, I'm going to make sure we can try to distract them maybe a little bit. I don't know where their port is. But we'll make them go boom anyways. Go ahead and dock there, just so that <clears throat> those guys feel supported. Very nice. Put you guys up here. Bomb them anyways, because we can. Because I told you to. Oh, nice. Yeah, they're completely surrounded. Go ahead and head and heal. There's really no point for you to bomb anyways, so just kind of hang out for now. Artillery. I mean, you, you really can't do much. I'm actually going to send you here, just because we can use Sousa, use artillery in Susa as kind of a defensive thing. So, and you might as well can you bomb? You can bomb. Nice. All right, not bad. All right, what can we build here in Lish? They have a granary, which is good. They could probably use a work boat, and they will build a worker. Yeah, why not? Because they want more workers, anyways. Production in Thebes. We finished the heroic epic. Uh, a settler, because why not? And we can produce something other than a research lab, like a police station, which costs some money. We'll build that because I don't want anything I build to cost that much money. And we'll build a harbor here to connect to our capital. Even though we're making so much money, we'll get some aluminum or use aluminum. Get an opera house. We'll get a what you call an opera house. And then we'll get what you call a factory as we adopt a new policy. That's completely useless. That's useless. Okay, one more happiness. We currently have how much happiness? We have 49. And we'll go up to 57. Not bad. Not bad. Not a great boost, but a pretty decent boost overall. Oh, Hannibal, you are here. Delightful. And they are killing my cavalry. Well, it wasn't the infantry I was expecting. Friendly trade up plundered. Attila put another figure out, and 
we're in the atomic era thank you very much guys we are finally in the atomic era we have a little bit of uranium discovered but we haven't quite extracted it yet now we have one more spy to use potential oh cities are growing quite a bit interesting awesome and what do we want next i kind of want Neuschwanstein. I actually really like Neuschwanstein because you get more plus two happiness, plus four culture, plus six gold, one more great merchant point. You get three gold, two culture, and one happiness from every freaking castle. That's amazing. I really like that. And you get railroads, which can really help out you with your roads. Because actually, it doesn't add production, I think. Something like that. It costs a little bit more, but it costs more production. Thebes will definitely build a Manhattan project. Allows you to build nukes. Love it. Seaport sounds good. Bank sounds good. And we have a couple units here. Just in case you'll also bomb this. I don't want to suffer too many casualties. That's not bad. But if this guy does it, he's going to suffer a little bit more. And I don't want to suffer too many. And Darius has been defeated. Goodbye, Darius. We will create a puppet. A loyal puppet. Go ahead and not hang out there because you can't. Alright, very nice. If I were to declare war on Attila next, I would need more units up here. So, lots of battleships. You guys will stay here, kind of hang out, watch the area. Uh, I'm going to put my artillery pieces up here. I'm going to keep my cavalry somewhat close here. I will keep the Great War Bomber over here. And artillery will just kind of remain there. I will build more artillery, though. You come up here, and then a workbook comes down here to do this. Now, infantry. I don't mind you staying right there. I don't mind you guys coming over here. Kind of guard the edges of our border. We have a new settler, which actually could prove to be very useful if I put one here. So it kind of acts as a deterrent to attack anyone else. Um, you know what? Let's, uh, I can't exactly do that. They come over here. They got food. They got sugar. It's an encampment. It's not a great place to put a good city, but, you know, it could be worse. Actually, there's down here. Yeah, down here is pretty good. Uh, horses, production, sheep, especially some steel and oil or whatever. Yeah, come over here. And I'm going to obviously need a unit down here. Actually, horses sound like a good idea. Horses, horses, horses. I should have not sent you that way, horses. My apologies. That's all right. That's totally alright with me. Alright. Uh, other than that, it looks pretty good. Oh, what's this? A William and Attila are killing each other. Very nice. So there's only three civs left. Me, William, and Attila. Oh! World Congress becomes United Nations. So we get six delegates for the host civ, four delegates for other civilizations, two delegates for city-state and world leader proposal on alternating thingamabobs. Actually, I'm going to take you out of here. I want the artillery to be there as well. <clears throat> cargo oh, cargo ship. Big boy. Come here. Great War Bomber, take a nap. Take a nap. You guys, come over here. Gamas come over here as well. Horses, probably deal with whatever's down here. Hopefully they won't have infantry barbarians. They do. And Manila has given us some uranium. And you only need to become influential with one more civilization to win. Well, it's easier to take an enemy out than actually become influential with them. And they're still, they're actually more happy than me, even though they have more civil resistance. <clears throat> Excuse me. Cultural victory. Now, how can I see how much more influential I have to be over them. Oh, here we go. So the Netherlands, we are a little influential. What do we need? We're familiar. Each trade route, we need more trade routes. We get more science from every trade route. Uh, spies establish surveillance. Hmm, interesting. Falling, that's not good. Plus 25. Bonus for tr open trade routes. We need Oh, we have different ideologies, which kind of hurts us. We need open borders, a shared religion, or propaganda from a diplomat. Well, we can probably do open borders and maybe a shared religion. Huh. I'm going to choose Attila to be leader. Wow. 38 versus... 36 versus 8. Yeah, let's do that. 
And I know it's costing me a lot to get more great profits, but I think it's worth it. Oh, battleship. We already have two here. Actually, I kind of want to explore this side. Hmm. Well, it looks like Attila just captured a boulder or whatever it is. Hmm. Hannibal. Hannibal. <clears throat> go and stay, go and sleep. Redeploy this. And we, yes. Now I will. Oh, Uthrak is getting attacked. Amsterdam. We do need to convert some of our newly covered cities, so we'll do that. Newly taken cities. 24, sounds good. Let's see. Oh, more influential with Bogata. Very nice. Canvasatori. Oh, Caravansary. Caravansary. I swear I know how to pronounce these guys. I swear. And we'll just end our turn since we're kind of waiting for things to happen. Oh, and convert our city. Very nice. Is there anything even over here? We don't even know. Oh. Aw. Attila planted the trade route between me and William. Alright, we completed the Manhattan Project, so everyone should be in fear of us. We have infantry over here. And actually, I'm going to see you over here anyways. Just go ahead and kind of stay here. We might need some extra backup. And we'll send you down here. Worker. You work. You guys get in here. You deploy, just in case. And... A market sounds like a good idea, but help us get bigger, better. And yeah, we'll do that, why not? And over here, we need more artillery. Straight up need more artillery. Walls sound good. Coliseum sounds good, and we'll end our turn. Hong Kong sees great rider. Edinburgh needs some investors. Artillery is going to take a nap. You guys are going to take a nap as well. Or be on the alert. Ooh, archaeology sounds pretty good. Maybe gets us more culture, more happiness from the castle. As well as artillery takes three turns. That's a little bit too much for me. We need more universities. And Attila has finally entered the modern era, even though I'm in the atomic era. And, oh, the Huns lost their capital. Oh boy. The Huns will be very weak now. So Attila's core is now owned by the Dutch. Hmm. Wow, they are really killing each other with outdated ships. This is what Darius must have felt like when he was trying to kill me. Quest. Unit promotion. Uh, you guys can come here. Hang out. Blow them up. More defense. And come over here just in case. Alright. Um, university. Yeah, let's push for more universities. Artillery is done. What can we build? Another cargo ship. Cavalry. Oh, I need. I can only build new Schwanstein if I'm close to a mountain. That's true. So, a cargo ship. And then, a police station. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, arsenal. Oh, when you get onto land. And then you. Sounds good. And, does anyone. Is anyone close to a mountain? That's a mountain. Braga, can you? Is anyone close to a mountain around here? Yeah, I think Braga will be the one that does it. <clears throat> we'll build them eventually. Ooh, and they... F what? A the wow. Oh my gosh, there's so many antiquity sites. So apparently Attila just entered the... Or adopted the autocracy. My ideology. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. Cargo ship. Oh, this is a new, brand new cargo ship. Trade route would open us, be make us more influential with them. But I don't want their religion in my lands. Their garbage religion. Um, twenty-four. No, that's garbage religion. Bucharest sounds good. Is anything down here? Well, I can start building up a ton of uh. Oh. I need to build a ton of researchers. Uh, archaeologists, that's what they call them. Yeah. Alright. 
oil? Yeah, we don't even... Oh, I guess I can see oil. So that's okay. Bank. Library, maybe for a little bit more research. Oh, a museum. Sounds absolutely delightful. Museum for everyone. Yeah. And one more turn before we switch Braga over to uh, other stuff. <laughs> nope. Sorry. Honestly, I'm probably going to kill them. Maybe. Tyre wants to do Schwanstein. Yeah, I know. Me too. Well, this looks pretty peaceful over here. I'm going to keep an eye on this. And we're going to convert that city next turn. Ooh, broadcast tower. Ooh, more culture in this city. Yeah, less. yes, please. Uh, welcome, great emperor. I'm pleased to announce that you also chosen to follow the path of autocracy. Well, there's only one true autocracy, and that's going to be me. Especially when I convert your city. Now, uh, William is really trying to kill these guys off. Ooh, biology, very nice. And let's use up the last of our profit to convert Groningen to Islam. Alright, refrigeration, stadium, hotel, it's not bad. What else do we want here? Ecology, free social policy. I like the free social policies. Great firewall, not bad. Uh, let's go with ecology. And here, let's get a university, because we can, and here we'll get a museum, because we can, and here we'll get a f university, because we can, and then we'll get a public school, because we can, because we want more science, and let's go ahead and annex the city. We lost 40, we 42, we lost 7 happiness, oh, buy that, Ooh, yeah, buy that, buy a courthouse, so we're back, oh, 54, that was even better than before, and is that all we can buy? That's realistically all that we really can buy. Except for a factory. Change production to New Schwanstein. Very cool. Oh, there's a lot of barbarians up here. Holy cow. Alright, so there's not really much up here. So we can settle up here. That'll be great if we can. Looks like a city used to be here, but maybe it was raised down. Alright. We finished a harbor. How about, let's get a seaport next. Followed by a museum. And then we'll have a broadcast tower over here, and we're going to start pumping out a ton more units. Enemy denunciation of you from the Netherlands has finished. We are in a golden era, or golden age. City connection established, and we killed a Hunnic spy. Well, thanks a lot, Attila. I really like you more now. Let's see, the last middle tenant we can choose. More happiness. Movement for great generals. Armor gets more attack. Movement and ignores zone of control. Uh, science and food is always nice. More strategic resources. Well, I think we have enough. Let's get more happiness. Now we're 86 happiness. That's a little overpowered, it feels like. We're going to put our unit down here just because we might be able to put a second city up here. Maybe. Especially when we take over Amsterdam. Maybe. Broadcast tower sounds good. Actually, no. You need to start producing some military units. Especially something like artillery. And then over here in Thebes, a hospital is nice, but we don't really need that. Hmm. Artillery is nice, but battleships are just so freaking strong. And we'll build a broadcast tower here, as well as a broadcast tower there, as well as a museum there. And or windmill sounds nice this time of year. Oh, and you guys, go ahead and move back over here. I really want to take out Rio, so that's why we're going to try to build up a few more battleships. And, uh, I forgive you. Since you're so weak anyways, I'm going to forgive you and then kill you later on. Later on. Alright, very nice. Oh, unit promoted. Awesome. Susa, you will become Islamic. You will gladly become Islamic, because I said so. And... But y'all sleep. Land units. Uh, let's get some more visibility range. Isn't really worth it. Land units, and then... More range. Yeah, that's good. That's good stuff. Where's our settler? We should be having a settler come in fairly soon. Actually, I'm going to send you guys over here anyways. Since that might... My artillery might be able to bomb into Rio from there. 
And a university was done. An amphitheater sounds nice. And another battleship since we have 32 oil. Oh, wait, I'm not set up. Oh, I need to buy a settler because, yeah. Leave City has a puppet. Ah, uh, you can buy a settler. Yeah. Very nice. Alright then. Oh wow, we have a lot of political a lot of political power now. But oh, Attila has almost none. We have a lot of military power. Go ahead and settle. Are they recommend up here? Huh. All right, that's interesting. Very interesting. Great profit. Uh, come on down here. And you, how close are we to finishing or being able to produce these? We need one more in Asyut. One more in Asyut. Oh, it's two turns, whatever. I want to produce it now. We have more than enough money, I don't really care. Three turns for that, so we're going to delay how long we're going to build a city. Artillery will come... Kind of hang out here. Our cavalry, you'll come down here and just kind of hang out. Hang out. And then... A suit built of that. A lighthouse sounds good. And we will build a hotel. Actually, we shouldn't build a hotel there. We should really build another military unit. Probably a battleship, honestly. Ooh, a sub. I love subs. Battleship. Down here, we will build a windmill. Yes. Very good. I don't know how much longer Attila can really hold out. The Netherlands does have quite a few planes. Five planes, it looks like, in total. A great writer has been born. A great musician has been born. Awesome. The cunning. Cool. And a great musician, George Gershwin. I got rid of them. Awesome. Calvary, you just kind of hang out down here. And I guess we'll elect a world leader, which will take a few turns for us to vote on. Very good. Uh, pass a god. Uh, yeah, research lab sounds pretty good. You guys will come up. Oh, they took that city? That's not good. Alright, we'll come up here then. It's fine with me. And we'll do the last few things before we end the episode. Alright. That sounds looks sounds and looks pretty good to me. Well, we've taken out Darius. We will begin tar starting to attack Rio de Janeiro soon. Next time. As well as maybe Groningen if we can get a few more battleships into place. So with that in mind, guys, thank you very much for watching. Next episode will probably will, will be probably the final episode for the Civ 5 campaign. It's been a lot of fun, but until then, I will see you later today with my Hoi 4 update, and thank you very much for watching. Leave a like if you like the video, subscribe if you're new, and I will, like I said, see you in Hoi 4. Thanks for watching.